So with Tippecanoe County, they, you know, they talked to us about this vote center idea and that they needed this electronic public kind of software. And I thought it was a good idea. And um, when I talked to them about uh, how we could do that for them uh, at Del Mar, you know, we can guarantee you that we're going to do a good job for you. There are many different types of electronic poll books, um, but ours has been specifically designed for uh, vote centers. And vote centers are a new model of um, conducting an election. If you're a registered voter in, the, in a county, you can go vote at any polling place in that county. In a traditional precinct-based election, right, you walk up and um, there's a book. But if we're going to let you, on election day, go vote at any do of a number of dozen, couple dozen places, I mean, we'd have to have a, uh, a huge book with every registered voter in it. What our electronic poll book is, it really is, it's an electronic version of that paper book and it serves as the gatekeeper. It's a real-time validation of the voter's eligibility to vote. And it does a number of other things um, to help the election workers um, manage the election, run more efficiently. They can see in real time um, how many vote voters have been processed so they can see, well, next year maybe we should add more voting machines at this location or we should add another location nearby. As the vote center concept goes on, it, they can continually refine it to uh, make it more make the elections more efficient. I, I think that Del Mar represents the model of what we're trying to accomplish here in the research park and in our technology centers. Their passion and their teamwork and their ability to get the job done, their ability to engage with others and when things get a little down to keep their spirits up and continue to uh, proceed with what needs to be done. It's a passionate and hard-working group. Winning the Indiana Innovation Awards is, you know, it's a great honor for us. It was a win for everybody, I think. It didn't cost that much to get it developed. It um, helps the taxpayers, it helps the voters, uh, helped Tippecanoe County, the people who run the election, and it helped us. It's nice to have a, a venue to kind of recognize some of the stuff that's happening.